Vidura College, Grade 2, Mathematics, Place Value, Part 2. Hello children, hope you are fine. Can you remember the last lesson? We learned about place value using straws. Hope you have completed all the activities. In today's lesson, we learn place value using blocks and rods. Let's learn what is a block. Here is a block. One block equal to one unit. One unit represents one block. Let's learn what is a rod. Count the blocks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten blocks equal to one rod. That means one rod is made with ten blocks. One rod represents number ten. Let's see how to show 15 with rods and blocks. One rod. One, two, three, four, five and five blocks. Make 15. 15 represents with one rod and five blocks. Let's see how to show 11 in the chart of tens and units. Look at the chart. Where is the rod? The rod in tens place. Where is the block? The block is in units place. 1 is in tens place, it is 10. 1 in the unit place, it is 1. 11 is represented by 1 rod of 10 and 1 block of unit. 1 10 and 1 unit equal to 11. Look at the chart. There are 2 rods in 10's place. 4 blocks in unit's place. 2 is in tens place, it is 20. 4 in the units place, it is 4. 2 tens and 4 units make 24. We will go to the next chart. Look at the chart. There are 3 rods in Tens place, five blocks in units place. Three is in tens place, it is thirty. Five in the units place, it is five. Three tens and five units make thirty five. Let's move to the next chart. Can you see there are 4 rods in tens place, 6 blocks in units place. 4 is in tens place, it is 40. 6 in the units place, it is 6. 4 tens and 6 units make 46. Activity 1. Fill in the blanks. Count the rods and blocks and find the numbers. Fun activities. Take building blocks or sticks. 
count and take the given number make rods with 10 blocks and units in blocks group into tens and ones find the tens and units of the numbers dear children i hope you enjoy the lesson stay safe bye